Python Hand Controlled Tetris. The basic concepts. Tetris. Using the Pygame library, we can first create Tetris, where the main part of the game runs on a while loop. In every iteration of the loop, we check what should be happening. Such as, should there be a new block coming in? Should the current block be going down? Should we clear a row? Did the player just command the current block to go left? If the answer is yes to a question, we execute that order. The while loop goes on until the player loses. Hand tracker. Using the OpenCV and MediaPipe library, we can then create a hand tracker, where the main part of it is also a while loop. We first use OpenCV to capture the video from our webcam, and because a video is simply a set of consecutive frame of images put together in order, we can use a while loop to go through each frame of the webcam video, in order to analyze it one by one. We analyze each frame using media pipe, which can recognize a hand, and can give us positions of the different points on your hand, also known as landmarks. We can then examine the position of these points relative to each other to see what hand gesture is on the screen. Combining the two, as you can see, both the game of Tetris and the hand tracker run on a main while loop. The idea is to combine these two while loop together into one. We start off similar to the normal Tetris while loop, where in each iteration, we'll check if something should be naturally happening in the game, such as, if a new piece should come in. But when it comes to player's command, the hand tracker comes into play. That is, in each iteration, there will also be media pipe analysis to see if the player is showing a certain hand gesture or not. If a certain hand gesture can be seen on the screen for enough consecutive frames, that is, the player held onto that gesture for enough time, the command associated with that gesture will be executed. The while loop then goes on until the player loses.